Welcome back, everyone. I've, for some reason, have ran into this issue 50,000 times, and there is a way to fix it. So basically, you may have just, you know, booted on your Mac, your iMac, whatever the case is, and the volume just isn't working. Now, like I said, this has happened to me 50,000 times, and for some reason, it always happens when I connect AirPods to my Mac or iMac, I disconnect them, and then... For some reason, the sound just isn't coming from my Mac anymore, and it's the weirdest thing. So in order to fix this, there's a couple of different ways, and this isn't the end-all be-all, but this is usually what works for me, and it's two different ways. The first thing I would recommend doing, which is sounds so easy to do, it sounds so simple, but it's something that a lot of people overlook. Sometimes when you connect an AirPods or a wireless Bluetooth device for audio output from your Mac, sometimes, for some reason, it requires you to decrease the volume all the way on your Mac and increase the volume back to whatever it was. So whenever this happens, basically, what I do is I take my volume and I bring it all the way down. And then once I see that little mute icon, I bring it all the way back up. And for some reason, I do not know why this tends to fix the issues. So either you can go into your search bar and to the music tab and the volume tab, go take it all the way down and bring it all the way up. Or you can just go into your keyboard, put the volume down, put it all the way up. And that should theoretically fix it for some people. Like I said, this could happen if you just rebooted your Mac or you have a Bluetooth connection, whatever the case is. Just doing that can actually end up fixing the volume sometimes. Now, if that doesn't end up fixing it, then the other way I would recommend doing is making sure there's not anything plugged in, no Bluetooth accessories that are outputting audio or whatever. If that doesn't happen, what you can do is you want to find the volume tab on your status bar or on your taskbar that's at the very top. And once you see that, what you want to do is you want to hold down the option key while you're pressing that down. So don't just press it down and you'll see the volume tab. You want to actually hold down the option key, press it, and you'll see this little output device and input device functions. Now, depending on what you're trying to output it to, most of the time, if it's this specific issue, you want to use the internal speakers. What you want to do is you want to highlight over the internal speaker and make sure, and the internal microphone, and you want to make sure there's a check mark next to both those. If there's not a check mark next to one of those or either of those, then I would recommend making sure you high click it and then it'll drop out. You can click it again and make sure both of those are highlighted and there's check marks next to the internal functions. Now, like I said, if you're trying to use a different sound thing, like a AirPods or something, then this is another way, as long as they're connected to device in there in your ear doing the same thing hold down the option and sound and you can see exactly where those sounds are coming from so that's exactly how i went ahead and fixed my specific sound issues that i was having again like i said it may not be an end-all be-all but those two things typically if i have sound issues usually fixes it bringing the volume all the way down and then bringing it back up or holding down option and selecting the internal speaker and internal microphone for whatever case i'm trying to do so that's really pretty much it. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. Every single subscriber that we get really does count, so it means so much if you guys can hit that. Also check out the other links down in the description as well. My Twitter, my Instagram, my other channels. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.